Hey guys, I hope everyone is doing well. Happy Friday to you. Um, I'm going to do just a quick haul video. Um, this is going to be from Tuesday morning, Michael's Hobby Lobby, and one, uh, one little thing that I got from Joann's. Okay, um, no specific order. Um, so Michael's has been, of course, having their Halloween stuff on sale for like bouncing between I think it's 60 and 70 percent off I think it's like 70 right now so I went there last week or no I'm sorry this week and happened to get this and this is just like the little physics kit from Tim Holtz and it has dies um stamps and an embossing folder so it actually has six dies it has an embossing folder and nine stamps so I don't know if you can see this right here at the top um, let me see if I can get the light a little bit better to show on this. Okay, hopefully y'all can see that. I don't know. Um, mm, I don't know. Okay, this is actually going to be what the stamps look like right there. Then the embossing folder looks just like that. Looks like I guess like a spider web. And then the little dies that cut out like that. And you can see what they look like on the package there. So I thought that was really cute. I want to say this is maybe like um, maybe seven or eight bucks. Um, so I think that was a really good deal for all of those items. So happy to get that. And you can sort of see on the back what it looks like. I like the saying where it just said, I love candy. So I thought that was cute. Boo. And with the little um, witch's hat and everything. So I thought that these were more, um, more cute than scary. So that's why I thought it was a good deal. Um... Also, I think for a while now that they've had like the print, the Prima marketing in the Finnebar, I guess that's what you call it. They've had this stuff on clearance for a while now. And every time that I've, I've seen, because I bought a lot of things that have been clearance from them. And this was another thing that I happened to pick up because I had seen this. And I want to say this was created from... Frank Garcia, I think that he is one of their, I know he's one of their creators, and he had talked about this book, I think, and so I thought it was a good deal. Um, I think it was like four bucks, so this is a mixed media book. I wish it had more pages in it, but I'm not mad at it. You know, it's got 28 pieces, it says, and it's got the craft paper, the regular like mixed media paper, then it's got like a photo photo um like a plastic sleeve you can put photos in and it's also got like a manila envelope and i like the little i like that the um the closure is sturdy so i like that that was a plus for me as you see like this is really sturdy the cover um front and back cover are really sturdy thick chipboard so you can see on the inside it's got the um the little manila envelope there and then it's got the pages here the white like mixed media pages those are the um for pictures and these are the craft sheets and then you've also got like something you can sort of like a little pocket that you can and um, that you can fit in the back so yeah um if i find any more i'm probably gonna snatch those up so that was all that i got from michael's um joann's had a coupon that i think ended on wednesday that was for 50 or 60 percent off um, I think it was 50, yeah, because, yeah, it was the same day that Michael's has theirs out that ends, Michael's ends Saturday, and Joanne's ended on Wednesday. So I wanted to get some Cricut embossing folders, but I guess anything related to Cricut is restricted, so I just ended up getting this, and these are some Diane Reevely, um Dilution Sprays. I know that they have two types, either, either the Shimmer or just the regular, um, plain like color and this is just the two colors that I thought that it's not something that colors that I usually have so this is called pomegranate seed and slate gray and that's just the regular ones the regular like pigment ink spray so got those and okay we're gonna go to Hobby Lobby Hobby Lobby of course still has tons of their clearance out and now it is the red tag so I just got these I can just throw these into any planner or any um, book or anything that I have just to help me with um, occasions and I also thought that with coming up with the Christmas holidays this is really going to help me for me to maybe just put on top of something else that I may not carry in the store with me all the time so I thought this was great and it was only like 89 cents and it has 24 double-sided sheets 
and they are ooh, what size in a something size and I don't know what it is but as you can see it's got either the back of the calendar that's gonna look like that and it's also got a note sheet or you can look or it's gonna look exactly like that but I think it has let's see not sure what it says at the top here what does it say oh it's just blank it's just blank up at the top and it's got holidays special occasions birthdays and notes so yeah okay um saw this and I've ne I've seen tons of project life things at um Tuesday morning didn't get any didn't get any of it um yeah they just never appealed to me but I happen to like this because this is an all-in-one kit so everything that's in here will allow you to create like I guess a not like just one week but I guess it will like maybe do like a whole what does it say um does it allow you to do okay so Project 52, does it do a whole 52 weeks? I guess it does, yeah. I guess here, I'm sorry, I'm out of frame. But I guess this will allow you to do a whole 52-week kit, which is really, really good. That's a, that's a good deal. And of course, like if you know anything about me, I love anything floral. So this comes with the album. Well, let me just open it up. Yeah, let me open it up. I wasn't sure I was going to keep it, but when I went to, um, when I went to Tuesday morning, I definitely did see... Um, because I got a like a little fabric album and I got it and I thought they were gonna have some more it was like four dollars I think I got it last year because I was gonna do the December daily and did not so um, this I only wanted the album but um, this is regularly what it would have been 30 bucks thanks and so this I'm not gonna open it up, it up all the way but you can see that this is the album right here, and I think uh, this is the album. So it's got the bind with it, which is floral. It's got the little houndstooth um, pattern on the back, and it comes with the cards here. And I wish it had some embellishments, but I can get embellishments anywhere, so that wasn't too big of a deal. And especially with this being my first time ever sort of learning about Project Life. So the kit includes journaling cards, 52 of them. 52 weekly cards and some more journaling cards um, that are three by four. So I'm assuming these are okay. So these are the these two right here have to be the weekly card and the journaling cards three by four in size. And these are the journaling cards that are four by six. So yeah, so got those there. And of course, the album, which is just too cute. And this is just what it actually is saying that it's going to look like. All those different designs. And it is the Maggie Holmes edition. So how can you not love that? Because I, of course if you shop at Tuesday morning, Maggie Holmes has a lot of her stuff there. Really, really thought that was a good deal. Um, also within the album, you also get the pocket pages. And you get 26 of those. So a really good deal for $7.50. Okay. Speaking of Tuesday morning, why not bring out the stash? Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. Not all this stuff is new, but if you know that you go to Tuesday morning, you just see any and everything there. So you just sort of rumble through what you want and grab it and go. Okay, this is a font punch. And I thought it was really cute because it's the smaller size. And I've seen these. I don't have a little letters i don't have like the um alphabet punch either the small one or the big one i will probably get one but i just thought this was a really little cute design to add on cars or even just like to use as confetti and it was only 199 look at it it's so cute and miniature how can you not like that so um in case you want the number there it is for you there Tw uh, 2016 222 Okay, and I think I'd seen this before also, but I had not seen this show up in my store. And there is a store that is probably about a good 20 minutes away from me. There's a store on my way to work and there's a store like right next to my job. So I get the best of both worlds. Um, so yeah, this was, ooh, this is back from September. So I don't know. I guess stuff just stays there. But I thought this was a really, really cute idea because I like the little um, the little notepad that came with this here. 
And I wasn't sure if it was a notepad at first or if it was actually the cards, but it is a notepad, which I'm even more excited about. Yeah, so I'm more excited about that. And the little stamp is Dear Lizzie. And these are all the sayings. So I just thought that was really cute. Um, so it could be a little stamp that I can take anywhere and it can actually do everything. So yeah, and I like that the date was not already put in there because that means it's more it's more useful. I have more uses for it. So like that. Um, and the number for this one, oops, hopefully, okay, there you go. That number is 2028395. Okay, all right. And of course, they, um, they're looking like they're doing another round of Spellbinder dies, and so I'm all ready for it because who doesn't love cheaper dies, right? And Spellbinder is, is, I love them, so yeah. This is one that I got here, and it's got four, um, four pieces here. I thought this was really, really elegant and pretty, so I really, really had to snatch this one up. Okay, this is called the Blooming Collection. Um, yeah. So, this is what it looks like there. Okay, and the number for that right there is there for you. 2047561. 2047561. Okay. The next one is three pieces, and this is called Labels 49 Decorative Accents. So, that's a mouthful there. Okay. Um... The number for this one is 2047586. Okay. The next one is called Fancy Framed Tags. And there are, oh, it's called Fancy Frames Tags 4. And there's six actual dice in this kit, in this one right here. And the number is right there for you. And it is 2047-572-2047-572. Okay. And the last one, I don't know, I just actually thought like a gingerbread house, even though it's not exactly like that. But this one is called the Floral Cottage. Okay. So y'all can see that a little bit better. And it's got three pieces. And that number is... 2047 563 Okay. All right. This was back when I was um, at another Tuesday morning that's nowhere near me. But I'm so glad that I got this because it is, it is way back. Y'all see that? It is way back in April. My birthday month. Yay. Okay. Not even sure if y'all will find this, but I will give you the number regardless. That number is 192 nine 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 two one nine two nine 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 two and this is the maggie holmes shape die there are seven pieces in here this is what it looks like there and i love that it already comes with a little plastic pouch right there so very very cute cannot wait to start playing around with this all right this is a embossing folder um, from Sizzix. Thought it was really cute. Of course, it has flowers on it. Anything floral is a place in my heart. Um, so this number is 1978-429-1978-429. Okay, this stamp right here, I wanted, I know I have a die from this and I've Cannot think if it's a bow bunny die or something like that, but I like this because it actually has the actual, um, you know, the states there. So I just really like that, and I like the little camper and the little car there. So wish I did not have to pay four bucks for it, but yikes! But I wanted it. The number for the Stampenda stamp is two zero four four nine four seven. Again, that is two zero four four nine four seven. Okay, Dear Lizzie Die Cuts, this is this from the Stargazer collection. There's 40 pieces. That number is right there, 2029, whoops, yeah, 2029-473, 2029-473. And that's what all of them look like. Thought that was very, very, very cute. Okay, and these are going to be some Bo Bunny stamps. Okay, 
thought this was really, these are not um, recent at all, but I, this is one that I had never seen before. This is Steampunk. I thought it was too cute. Ugh, too cute. Okay, the number for this one is 2028-339. 2028-339. Okay. Next one is the bicycles. Thought that was too, too, too cute. Had to get that. 2028-343. 2028-343. Next one is the romance stamp. Sort of reminds me of a Paris theme that I want to do. So that number is 2036-163. 2036163. These are kitchen icons. Undecided on that one, but I like the little teapot, so I'll probably make this work. Um, I don't know why it says typewriter kits, but we'll rock with it. The number for this one is, and y'all, I'm not sure if this number is going to go to the right item. I'm not sure at all. Um, so, but I'm going to give it to you anyway. 2028332. 2028332. Yeah, I don't think that number is right at all. Okay. Found these Maggie Holmes wood frames, and there are four of them. There's that oval one, then there's like that square, there's another one there, and there's that one. Very, very, very cute. If I can find any more of these, I will definitely snatch them up. Very, very cute. Which the only thing that they probably had is that they were lighter in color, but you know, you'll make it work. Um, the this is from the floor the flourish collection. That number is two zero four five zero four six two zero four five zero four six. I think that was a great price for those. And these are Heidi Swipe Heidi Swap with veneers. This one says Hello Sunshine, ninety nine cents. Great deal. Two zero two nine four nine nine two zero two nine four nine nine. Okay, the other one says Journey. Nice. 2029 505. 2029 505. Maggie Holmes stickers. Um, this one is from the Bloom, I think the Bloom, Maggie Holmes Bloom collection. So, yeah, all of these little cute stickers there. And the number is 2045053. 2045053. And yeah, shows them all right there for you. And the last item are these little cute word bubble stickers. And they are 99 cents. Could not leave that there. The number is 2043866. 2043866. That is all that I have for you guys. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.